Hi guys, so um, today's video is going to be on long division. I wanted to review this with you. Um, I know this is something that we can sometimes struggle with and I just wanted to make sure that you're still practicing it because it's very important. So we would need to remember that when we divide, um, we have steps that we follow. First we need to divide, then multiply, subtract, bring down, then we will either repeat the process or we'll have a remainder. And if you remember, we used a family to help us remember that. So my drawing is not very good on the board at school or on this um, iPad, but we're going to look at it like this. Dad tells us that we need to divide. Mom tells us that we need to multiply. Bro uh, sister tells us that we need to subtract. Man, look at her hair. Brother, he's going to tell us to bring down. And then we have Rover. Um, whew, trying, guys. All right, and Rover tells us whether we need to repeat or if we're going to have a remainder. Okay, I do want to go ahead and say y'all are doing amazing at doing your iReady lessons. Please don't stop. Keep up the good work. Um, I really do miss you guys, and I can't wait till we get back in the classroom. All right, so let's look at example number one. Okay, there we go. All right. So, we have 1,235 divided by 5. First, I'm going to say the 5 cannot go into the 1. So, we put an X above the 1. But 5 can go into the 12 twice. 5 times 2 is 10. 2 minus 0 is 0. I mean, it's 2, and I bring down my 3. So, now I have to say... 5 can go into 23 four times. 4 times 5 is 20. My sub I subtract and have 3, and I bring down my 5. So, 5 will go into 35 7 times. 7 times 5 is 35, so I have no remainders. Alright, let's do another problem. Remember, we're going to divide, multiply, subtract, bring down, and then repeat or find our remainder. All right, this problem, I have the number 1,338 divided by 3. 3 cannot go into the 1, so I put an X there. 3 will go into 13 four times. 4 times 3 is 12. I subtract and bring down my, uh, 3 minus 2 is 1, I bring down my 3. Again, I have the same number there, so I know that 4, uh, so I knew to put the 4 there, uh, subtract by 12, and I have 1 left over. Then it leaves me with 18, and uh, 3 will go into 18 6 times, no remainder. Alright guys, I'm getting the hang of this, so next time I'll do it a little slower. Alright. Uh, number three, I have 3,319 divided by four. Four will not go into the three, but it will go into 33, how many times? Eight. Eight times four is 32. Subtract. I have one left over and I bring down my one. 4 will go into 11 twice. 2 times 4 is 8. When I subtract, I have 3 left over. And then I bring down my 9. 4 will go into 39 how many times? I really hope you're practicing your multiplication facts. That's very important. 4 will go into 39 9 times. 9 times 4 is 36. Sorry. Here we go. And we have three left over. So this is the first one that we have a remainder. There's nothing else to bring down. All right, let's do another one. Okay. 
this one. I have the number 5,104 divided by 9. I know 9 will not go into 5, but it will go into 51 how many times? I hope you said 5. 5 times 9 is 45. All right. I have to borrow here to be able to subtract. So that 1 becomes an 11 and the 5 become a 4. 11 minus 5 is 6, and I bring down my 0. 9 will go into 60. How many times? 6. Very good. 6 times 9 is 54, and I have a remainder of 6. So I bring down my 4. 9 will go into 64 7 times. 7 times 9 is 63, and I have 1 left over. So my answer is 567 with a remainder of 1. All right, guys, I want to do one more problem with you. I hope this has helped you just review and get the hang of division. Um, I know you guys are keeping up all the hard work. All right, so we have 4,865 divided by 7. 7 will not go into the 4, but it will go into 48 6 times. 6 times 7 is 42. 8 minus 2 is 6, and I bring down my 6. 7 will go into 66 9 times. 9 times 7 is 63. 6 minus 3 is 3, and I bring down my 5. 7 will go into 35 five times. 5 times 7 is 35, so I have no remainder. All right, guys, again, do your already lessons, practice your multiplication facts, and just keep up all the hard work. Know that I love and miss you all and can't wait to see you soon.